Okay, so let's solve this problem. So a used car dealer finds that in any day, the probability of selling no car is 0 0.4, one car is 0 0.2, two cars is 0 0.15, three cars is 0 0.10, four cars is 0 0.08, five cars that's 0 0.06, and 6 cars is 0 0.01. So if the salesman gets a commission of 1,000 pesos for each car sold, then how much is the expected earnings of the salesman? So first we need to create a probability distribution of x. So x for the commission or the expected value, then p of x for the probability of the expected value, then x times the p of x, so multiply x and the p of x. Now, since the commission is 1,000 for every car, so therefore, if no car sold, then the commission is 0. If one car, that's 1,000. For two cars, that's 2,000. For three cars, that's 3,000. For four cars, that's 4,000. For 5 cars, that's 5,000. And for 6 cars, that's 6,000. Then the probability of having a zero commission, so we have this 0 0.04. For 1,000 or 1 car, that's 0 0.2. For 2,000, that's 2 cars, 0 0.15. Then for 3,000, the 3 cars, 0 0.10. For 4,000, that 4 cars, 0 0.08. For 5,000, that 5 cars, 0 0.06. And for 6,000, that 6 cars, 0 0.01. So to compute now for the expected value, so first we need to solve first this x times the p of x, so the product of x and the p of x. So this one, 0 times 0 0.04, this one is 0, then 1000 times 0 0.2, so using calculator, times 0 0.2, that's 200. Then this 2000 times 0 0.15, so 2,000 times 0.15, that's 300. 3,000 times 0.10, so 3,000 times 0.10, that's 300. 4,000 times 0.08, 4,000 times 0.08, that's 320, 5,000 times 0 0.06, so 5,000 times 0 0.06, that's 300. Then the last one, 6,000 times 0 0.01, 6,000 times 0 0.01, that's 60. So to compute now for the expected value, so add all these numbers. So that's uh, 0 plus 200 plus 300 plus 300 plus 320 plus 300 and plus 60. So this is now the expected value, 1,480. So therefore, the salesman is expected to earn 1,480 pesos.